Hey, I'm A1C McReynolds. Uh, my job is 2A832 Bravo. It's uh, instrument and flight controls on the C-17s. I'm from Bristol, Tennessee. And uh, some of my hobbies are playing basketball, uh, working out, you know, all the good stuff. All right, where'd you go to high school at? To high school at Tennessee High. Tennessee High. Did you play basketball there? Yep, played basketball there. Were you any good? Football. Yeah, it was great. Okay. Uh, best right. player on the team, actually. You know. Okay. All right. Uh, where'd you go to college at? I went to the University of Tennessee at Chattanooga. Okay. Their mocks. Awesome. So why did you so decide to join the Air Force? Uh, I didn't really know what I wanted to do in college. I was kind of switching through majors and uh, wasn't quite sure. So I thought... Uh, what better thing to do than serve my country for a little while. All right. How do you like it so far? Love it so far. Okay, so you just got out of tech school and you're here on the recruiter assistance program. Um, so what base are you going to? Going to McGuire in New Jersey. McGuire, all right. You excited about that? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of close to home, right? Yeah, I mean, nine it's not hours. too far. Nine hours. Yeah, that's not bad. Never lived in cities like that before. Close to New York City and Philadelphia. So, all right, so you get some traveling in and all that. All right, so tell us a little bit about the job. So how was tech school? What kind of stuff did you learn? Uh, you start off in tech school learning basic electronics. It's called electronic principles. And uh, you learn all kinds of stuff, uh, circuitry and all that. And then uh, you go into a little bit further into like your specific job like your aircraft and that okay so what what systems specifically are you working on on the aircraft uh, just all the flight control systems within I mean you may have seen pictures like in the cockpit like you're like oh my gosh like what are all these lights and like what do they do uh, you pretty much learn a little bit of all of that uh, the wiring that goes to them what might something that might break that would cause them to mess up during flight okay all right awesome all right, so um, how long was your tech school? It was four months, four and a half months, actually. Four months, and where was it? It was in Shepherd Air Force Base, Okay, Texas. well, what was the life like during tech school? Hot. It's hot? Texas is hot. All right, okay. So was it kind of like, was it, you know, a little bit stressful maybe? Was it... Tech school's pretty laid back. It can be stressful at times. I mean, you got a test coming up or something. I mean, you got to study just like any... Uh, in school test, you know. Okay. How would you compare it to your college experience? Uh, it's definitely a little more strict. Keeps you in line, and uh, that was a lot better for me, in a way. But it's not strict enough to where you feel like you're being watched at all times or anything. You have freedoms in tech school, unlike BMT. Gotcha. Okay. How was your BMT experience? Uh, fantastic. Fantastic. All right. Yeah. Did you get yelled at a little bit? Yeah, just a little bit. Not too bad. <laughs> All right, so what would you say to somebody that was maybe on the fence about um, joining the Air Force or maybe they're looking into electronics jobs or something like that? Well, if you're looking for electronics jobs, I mean, all these jobs, especially the electronic field, will transfer over to the civilian world. So you get in, get paid to learn how to do your job, learn it, transfer over. I mean, you may even make a career out of it. You never know. Cool. All right. Awesome. Anything else you want? the viewers to know about Air Force life or anything for a new airman? Uh, um, no, not that I can think of. Okay, all right, covered it all, huh? Yeah, I think so. Cool, all right, well, I appreciate your time and good luck in your career. Thank you.